All right, it's time for our plays. City of Skylines 2. Here we are. Um, I believe. Right where our city began. But I could be wrong. Let me. Yep. Uh, this is the initial entrance from the highway. So we've got a few cars queuing up here. Um, waiting for the light to go. This is probably another one of those situations where it'd be nice if I could um, maybe control what's a traffic light and what is a stop sign, but that's okay. So we do have the uh, interchange back here where people can get off and go to different places. Um, it may be the case that uh, we need another one, perhaps, or some kind of situation here to maybe lessen the traffic load. I guess it depends where people are going, but perhaps if people happen to be heading towards, um, well, let's see. They happen to be heading towards this residential. Maybe we make a little little bypass or something for them because there's a lot of people queuing up here. So what if we did a one way two road that kind of starts? Oh, first of all, hold on. Let me set this to curve. I'm going to. Let's see. Actually, before I do that. Let's see if I were to widen. How much of this would it do? And where would it start? So if I kind of went like maybe here. All right, let's go there. And then let's go to our streets. So we've got one starting off. So maybe we do. So let me just do regular road at first. So we're going to come off at an angle here, right? So. So you can get off there, okay. And now let's become a two. Now let's curve. Now if we go up and curve, there we go. So now, if any of these people actually wanted to come into this neighborhood, um, they could do that. So it might take some time before people want to, or maybe no one wants to. Maybe they just want to go downtown here. Um, not sure if there's anything else I could do to alleviate things here other than I guess if we change this to a roundabout, then maybe people don't have to wait as long. That would probably destroy at least this building. Might be worth doing. I'm not sure. Let's see. So, is anybody going there? Some people going that way. But it appears most people want to go this way. To go where? That's the quick, the interesting question. <laughs> yeah, the only thing I could think is that perhaps Yeah, let's try a roundabout because then people don't have to keep waiting here, right? Question is, I've only got the, the tiny one, which is probably too tiny, but let's give it a shot. We did that. Just killed those businesses, but now let's see if traffic improves.
Mm -mm -mm. I do not want this business to be on this road. So let's do that. All right. If this clears anything up yet. Oh, we do have six points. Maybe we unlock the larger one then. Let's see. All right, let's see. Well, maybe this is working. Maybe this is doing what we needed to do. Definitely everyone wants to go on Main Street. I can do that. All right, now we still got quite a backup. Let's try medium. Maybe that gives some people ability to just turn right, right there if they want to. This is getting utilized, so some people did want to go that way, so that's good. Probably taking some of the traffic off of Birdsong Street here. <coughs> this looks like some cars are getting randomly stuck, which is probably not helping with the traffic situation, but... Looks like most people are trying to go forward. Only a few people are trying to turn. Yep, yep, yep. It is just... It's not happening, man. Um, I wonder if I made another one that came this way, but that would require quite a few tiles. Um, let's come back over here for a minute. Alright, this could definitely use some work, now that I know how to do it better, but... Um... It's like a really bad version of that type of... Where? Oh, they need more customers. Alright, let's see here. Yeah, so these people are going this way. Get out of here. Most of the people... I think if there's anything... more we can do here. Let's try increasing the capacity one more time, see if that helps. Give the cars a minute to figure out where they want to go. Now they've got a dedicated right lane, I believe. All right, looks like we finally cleared it up. Maybe that's all we need, just a big enough roundabout. All right, cool. That problem is fixed. Maybe here we can stick like a little plaza or something. Let's see. Why is a small plaza so bloody huge? That doesn't make any sense. Understand, do they know what small means? Exercise after work. All right, so we solved that problem. Good. 
All right, so I have three goals for today. I want to fill out more of the university area. I want to connect these two um, areas and make a tram if that's not too uh, busy. All right, so we've got a fire here. Hopefully, we've got a fire truck coming. Let's see. Yeah, they should be covered still. So there should be a fire truck coming. There it is, I think. All right, so let's start off with um, the university. All right, so let's do. I think, well, first of all, I think I want to make like a little forest over here. Kind of between these two areas here. All right. So if we come over here. Let's do our. This is second moon with. J. Thomas Hornbuckle. Before we dive into our next selection, I'd like to take a few memento moris. Oops. Elaborate on the formal structure of the symphonic work. For our newer, less able listeners, first, we will be dancing through the al dente section before entering the slower largo movement, finally, then savoring the vivacious anti pass All right, and I think we're going to stop there to leave some right of way for the highway. A housing shortage is driving up prices in the area. That's right, Glenda. But apparently, that's not all good news. We're joined today by an expert guest, Professor mm. Nutbutter. Welcome, Professor. So a housing right. shortage is bad. And trying to move here, right? Go back. A program to Make a small one there, just to not have two that are too close to each other. Make these narrow. The actual rewards enjoyed. For example, consider capital. One, right, one final question, Professor. Is the housing shortage going to make me richer? By certain metrics, perhaps yes, in the short term. I like the sound of that. But what we are discussing is the study of a statistical abstraction and its effect on the human. Thank psyche. you, Professor. It is a question of priority. The leader of the city services division is with us in the studio. Say that again. They should talk about why they're contracting with outside agencies to provide yep. services for our residents. Is, is dark green? Be costly, Mr. Councilman. Uh, no. Well, quite frankly, yes. It is dark green? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The residents have come to all right, so let's go all the way across here. Is that for people to have the capacity to yeah. provide them within the city? Sounds like I think people walk and up paying for it. Mm, so they don't have to always take their cars. I expect the residents would be more distressed. Mm -hmm. Services become unavailable. All right, so let's go ahead and it's gonna be like a little neighborhood that's near the university. I think we'll have these for these up here will be commercial. I think that makes the most sense. Then we'll let these be houses. And then we'll go from all this will be houses. All right. Should take care of that. I think we can have another intersection right here. Okay. And then um, here, we're going to do a parking lot. Or I won't. There we go. 
and then I'll do some more commercial. Just like that. Okay. Excellent. All right, let's keep going here with some pathing. And back here, we'll plant some trees. Okay. Um, all right. And what I'm going to keep doing is I'm going to make... Um, more dorms on it. Well, you know what? Before I make, I'm going to save this for in case I need more space for university campus things, but I will zone uh, commercial here. I'll let it be a big one. All right. <laughs> okay. So. That's kind of what I wanted to do in this area for now. Um, there's a fire here. Do these people have fire coverage? They're supposed to, uh, except back there. So why don't we put a fire department here that's for the university? Maybe we'll put it on this side. Uh, does that make sense near the dorms? I guess it makes more sense on this side. We'll put that there. Um. Um, so that takes care of that. Uh, looks like it's awesome, so don't know what they were unhappy about. Um, so we've potentially got the high rent bug there. We've got lack of customers there. All right, so, um, you know what? I think here... Can't afford crematorium. Like almost all my money. But you know what? I think fine. We'll let there be a cemetery here because it'll also provide some park land. Um. I think what I want to do. Let's continue this road out. We can put it against that road. Okay. We will continue this out. Leave some room for its extra building. Let's see if that Leaves us the room. Yep. And yep. Okay, so it's got its room. Okay, so that should help. Um, Alright, so I'm going to keep going this way with um, this plan, except I'm going to have a little more... Should I have some more commercial? No, because I think these people were complaining that I have enough customers. So, um, I'm going to continue going this way. These were kind of work, work but, uh, and a squat blocks. Oh, I may have messed up on this road here. Let's see. All right. I'm going to need to I'll move this guy for a second. Put it over there for a minute.
Okay. I think that fixed it. There we go. Okay. Alright, so let's continue this here. And the final one will go out a little bit extra. Okay, perfect. All right, so this is basically their park, so they don't need a park at the moment. So we're just gonna do some more zoning here. Okay. All right, so why did I curve that in such a strange way? Oh, that might have been like where this uh, one of these things was. All right, so there's zero vehicles in use. I know there are people here who need hearses. That's kind of weird. Maybe it takes time for it to realize it's got something here. All right, we're going to continue here. Watch it for the highway. Yeah. There. And just get there and over. stuff off. Okay. Um, and then here we're getting a little too close to the highway, so we're gonna go I'm gonna go with this one here. So let's see, let's put in here, let's put a little arc of some sort. Let's do a tennis court like right there. Let's go road, turn things on, turn on curves, go out, curve that. So that leaves me some room there on the highway. Um, all right, so as we continue to go out, Let's go there. Nope. All right. Then so I think you know what? Because it's a country road at the moment, we'll allow it to up. And straight out the other side, we'll do a curve tool. So we'll go out at 180. Curve into there. Okay, so now this is less of a isolated community here. Right? And I think we could Put a little commercial right in here. And then go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and put some row homes here. 
even though we don't need density right now. Put these guys here. All right, we'll leave that alone there. This here. Do some parking here. Or not. Maybe here. Do kind of like a little transition area here. So the residential. A driving advisory has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Okay. Please exercise caution if you must drive and try to stay off the All streets right. until conditions improve. This has been a local public service announcement. So that leaves You're room back. for the highway there. Radio, your second musical home from home. So settle back in your chair, pour yourself a glass, and prepare for another hour of musical delight. Tonight we are doing a musical tour All right. of Italia. We were to do Art and Estrial. <laughs> Which way is the wind blowing? Going up that way. Inspired by the infamous Vivaldi. Shall we go here. Industry in the region up that way. On the rise, and when business is doing well, that floats our boat. There's no sinking this boat, Glenda. And on to our main feature story. The commercial district is booming as the area is attracting more high-end stores, bringing the latest in luxury to our neighborhood. You can now <laughs> shop for designer shoes while sipping a fancy local Jarva Mate, or so my wife tells me. That's good for business and good for the community. Thanks, Jim. All right. We'll be back after this. Let's fix this insanity that I did here. My really messed up park low. Okay, so what we really just need... Let's see here. I guess really what happened is I went way wider than I needed to. Um, but if I think, I'm trying to think about what um, City Planner Plays did when he did his. Because he kind of had him like coming in and out at the same place. Um, I guess it doesn't really matter. I'm not going to worry about it right now. All right, so... I wanted to work on my tram network. However, before I do that... Oh, I'm glad there's no more traffic here now. Um, let's see. All right, let's go ahead and build out a little more industrial here. We'll do industrial like that. A parking lot going. And put some more industrial here. All right, and we should probably keep growing out the residential that I've got here. Although I think realistically I need to buy this square first. But I don't have the money, so...
I guess. I'm trying to think what makes the most logical sense. We're kind of starting to catch up with this farm here, but you know, sometimes um, cities do kind of catch up with farms in a way. Um, well, even though meant for the university to be separate, maybe maybe these two end up touching. Let's see, well, but we are about to get an upgrade which will come with money, so let's see here. Our highway, right? Yeah. Alright, so what if where does it actually make the most sense? I guess continuing back here maybe makes the most sense. about 105, I guess. Let's go out to... Oh, it's not what I wanted. Let's try that again. We got one. One, two, three, four streets coming in. No, one, two, three, four, five streets coming in. I think this is perfect candidate for a small roundabout. Hmm. Larger roundabout? Even bigger roundabout? Biggest roundabout? Okay. Um. No. But what I think I want to do is we'll make this make a little more sense. We'll go from there. That was probably the decision I made where at the time I didn't have the money to make what I wanted. All right, what if we went like that? Three, and then this guy goes up. There we go. That makes a bit more sense. All right, let's finish this up here. Okay, we'll do our paths. Go ahead and do some residential in here then. All right, we've got the film actor mansion. Very nice. You think you would want to live near the rock and roll guy? Where's that guy? Where the heck did I put him? He was over here somewhere. I'll find him in a minute. Before I forget, we should probably have a little more commercial over here somewhere. But... Where's my rock star? Oh, here he is. Nice. Oh, I made his house look really nice. Look at that. <laughs> Oh man, look at that. He's got those uh, fortunate smokestacks in the background, but. 
All right. Um, let's see here. So, let's see the film star. I'm going to make the film star kind of like have his own little corner back here, back there, or a hit here wouldn't make sense. He wouldn't be there. What is, what does his special building give you? Well-being. Let's see. You know what? He would probably be here by the river, actually. Um, let's see. Something like that. Alright, so let's see. But what if coming out of here we have Alley? Let's go. Let's see. We'd come off of here, off of the main drag. Curve around. Then this guy. Let me place them and then we'll figure this out. That's the front, right? Yeah. We'll do something. Oh, damn it, it got turned. Right. Put it like right there. Ooh. All right, so. All right. That's there. And then that's the back, his backyard. So I would say, out of his backyard, he's looking out that way. He probably doesn't want these two trees here. That one's okay. And so, and he wouldn't want to see any of this over here. So. Let's go to trees. And we'll do lots of trees. Not behind him, though. Observe that landscaping. Okay, cool. And then let's say about here, we would allow potentially another neighborhood to start. So all this land is his land here. from the noise of the city right away recent spikes in demand have led to temporary local shortages right, cool. in the city's fresh water supply the public should be aware that we are struggling to get the situation in hand this All right. has been a local public service announcement there we go Pending updates to our power grid the city will be experiencing rolling blackouts we urge the public to remain calm during these breaks in service and to follow the guidelines on the All right, so I'm going to go ahead and do the um and for these temporary events. This has been a local public service announcement. How delightful. Another Bams, let's see. Our erstwhile listeners. Hmm. 
What's up, honey? Me and my sister love you. Oh, that's nice. Y'all got clarinets and violins. Ah, so now we've got high density housing. These days ain't. Oh, let me and oil drilling. Back to the great Hayden himself. Hmm? Let's see here. Y'all got soul. Oh, yes. Okay. Alright, so. We went uh, here. My sisters say whoever you got playing the keys got more funk in his pinky. Hmm, but I told her that ain't <laughs> funk. That's classical. Yes, indeed. That must be most exacerbating. Classical music has been known since the time of the early explorers. Funk, by contrast, is an entirely modern conceit, and you'll find none of that here. Funk All right, I think let's do. Let's see. Person. Now let's hear another one of those soul let's go. Camps. We're we're live, um, and we're gonna. Right, we're gonna go like that. Accident. Uh, somewhere uh, in the city. Road maintenance services. I have a road. Traffic flow should return to normal, but if you're planning a quick trip out, you might want to wait a little while until everything clears up. If you're in it, you uh, you already know about it. No use reminding mm -hmm. you. Meanwhile, uh, expect delays and drive safe. All right. So now, if we go to Tram, let's see. So what do I want to do? I think I do want to allow people to come. I was thinking maybe skipping some things with him, but... So a housing shortage is bad for the people trying to move here, right? Humans are programmed to desire certain representations within ideological reward structures, which are entirely apart from the actual rewards enjoyed. For example, consider... All right, I think what I'm going to do is go through industrial... Through Matrix, perhaps, yes, downtown, something like that. So let's see. But what we are discussing is the study of a statistical abstraction and its effect on the human. Thank psyche. you, Professor. It is a question of priorities. All right. So this creates crossing area. Do something like that. Yeah. Which apparently means I'm going to be going that way. Does that make sense? I don't think it does. All right. Let's bring this down a little bit. Okay. Start this one again. Let's do. Let's do a curve. I'm gonna go curve in like that. There we go. Um, let's get rid of. Crossing. There we go. Okay. Now, if we go to road, we have. If we go here now. Alright, so we're gonna go this way. We want to be. Well, I think that's why we want to get out of the industrial zone as quickly as we can. We go back here behind. Then out that way. Hmm. <laughs> no, sure, why not? Okay. Um, how do I go in the middle? Oh, maybe that's a slightly bigger road. Alright, um, we don't want to hit the highway roundabout, so we're going to go this way. Alright, now we're going to go 
Here, can we go in the middle or no? Yeah, I guess that's the bigger road. All right, that's okay though. So we're gonna go this way. Way. Go pretty much all the way downtown. All right, we'll cut back around this way. All right, cool. And this will allow here on the. Where did I? Oops, I lost track of where I was. Okay, we're gonna go here. There we go. Uh. Whoopsie daisy. All right. here. Okay, so I'm going this way now. Alright, where did I join up before? Because I would like to offer in both directions for most of these. All right, so All right, cool. So we did that. Let's do the stops. So we come out of here. Go. Let's see, here we'll do here and here. Go down a bit. Here. All right. Go. Here and here. And now that we're here. In here. Here and here. Here and here. Let's see how that's looking. All right. Nothing there to stop at. I think let's do maybe one last one here. Uh, here. No, those people can walk. Okay, I think we're probably okay. Alright. Now let's do our line. So we're gonna start there. 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 So what if we went, let's see, how would this work if I went from here to, oh wait, jumps on the other side or something? That's weird. Okay, well. Oh, because these are two-way, that's why. Right, so if I went there, what would it do? Oh, it would like ping-pong. It's really weird. Maybe I'll just have two, one that goes one way, one that goes the other way. 
In which case, should I have just done a one-way track? I'm not sure. But if I now turn around here... All right, let me see. Let me uh, get rid of that one. Get rid of that one. And what if I just head back now here? not on this side of the road? What's going on here? Hmm. What am I misunderstanding here? Let's see. I think I messed up here. Why? I think I put these both on the same side of the street. Yeah, do these? No, these are rams. Okay, I've got way too many so going on. Okay, those are on different sides of the street. These are on different sides of the street, okay. Maybe I just need to be zoomed in more when I'm making... These are clearly on opposite sides of the street. Alright, let me be, maybe be more zoomed in. Let's see. From here... This side... A driving advisory has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise caution if you must drive, and try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. Mm -hmm. This has been a local public service announcement. You're back with Second Moon Radio. Alright. So now, what if I go back the other way? A 
pass and prepare for another hour of musical delight. Tonight, we are doing a musical tour of Italia. Mm -hmm. Land of art and culture. <laughs> que bon, as they say. And an aria inspired by the infamous Vivaldi. And on to our main feature story. The commercial district is booming as the area is attracting more high-end services, <laughs> bringing the latest in luxury to our neighborhood. You can now shop your designer shoes while sipping a fancy local Jarva Mate. Or so my wife tells me. That's good for business and good for the community. Thanks, Jim. We'll be back after this. Industry oh, yeah. region is on the rise, and when business is doing That's well, it. that floats our boat. There's no sinking this boat, Glenda. Okay. Alright, uh, there we go. Alright, now we're heading back this. done actually let's can we stop here and then be done there we go all right cool all right so we've got a route let's see there he goes All right, let's. Hey, there goes another one. Follow this dude. This will be our cinematic for this episode. Uh. This is what the. Like too many of these guys. Do that. Where are my? All right, here they go. I think this is the guy in front. All right. So we're going through our um, industrial neighborhood. To see some people walking.
That's funny, all those people were waiting for it to turn around to get on. 